Hey, hey, what is up, Credit Movement community? It's Ryan. This is uh, episode 52 of the Daily Credit Minute. And I'm here in my home office, and I had to show you guys this because I think it's pretty powerful. You hear me talk all the time about how paying a collection can actually lower your credit score. Um, take a look at this. If you look at this credit report, right down here, you see where it says SCE. There's some Cs there. That just stands for co-borrower. And then it says SCE. I uh, blacked out the account number. Um, and then if you look over here, you see where it says paid charge off. So it's a paid collection or charge off. It's showing it only reporting to XP, which is Experian and EF, which is Equifax. Interestingly enough, if you look up here at the scores, it's not reporting to TransUnion. Look at that TransUnion score, 809. Experian is 731. Look over at this page, Equifax is 725. So literally 725 for Equifax, 731 for Experian. Those are the two bureaus that the collection is reporting to, even though it's paid. TransUnion is 809, 80 points higher. So that goes to show you guys that paying a collection doesn't necessarily mean your credit score is going up. It could actually lower your score. So you need to know how to challenge those items and get them removed after the fact. I hope this helps you guys out. I wanted to show you some real life examples here. Uh, like our page, share our posts, and as always, keep coming back for more, and I'll keep bringing you quality credit content. Hope it helps you guys out.